Hey, what's up? I'm Rachel Starr, paranoid schizophrenic here. Um, pretty much going to talk about tardive dyskinesia. Um, really interesting because when I was um, doing some research, I realized that there's not much um, video of it online, which is crazy considering we live in YouTube and stuff. And I was like, well, let me go through my records and maybe make this video uh, to kind of give people some examples. So basically what tardive dyskinesia is, is it's when someone has been on an antipsychotic uh, for a prolonged amount of time and it kind of starts messing with your motor skills. Uh, and, and the worst part that I have is I have these weird tongue movements. Um, I call it like demon tongue or I'll even tell you that's my tongue is just being weird. Um, I started noticing it about three years ago and I don't know what I was doing but I remember I was like sitting in bed probably like, like that's kind of like my desk sometimes. So I had like stuff spread on my head and I was doing something. Um, and I, I realized that like, my tongue was moving all around in my mouth and I just remember thinking, well, that's weird. What am I doing? You know, and I was just kind of like, I just realized it was happening. Um, and then I, I kind of noticed it more and more. This past year, it's been pretty bad. Um, recently I came out with my bodyboarding um, video and I had to scrap like 90% of the footage I shot because I'm doing that weird tongue thing. Um, and it just looks really creepy. Like if you're just watching the raw footage, you're like, Rachel, what are you doing with your tongue? And it's just like, like going all over the place. Um, and it's crazy because it's like, I, I don't realize I'm doing it. I don't feel it. And you think you would feel your tongue hanging out of your mouth, but, but I don't. Um, it happens a lot when I'm at the gym working out and I'll suddenly like, you know, glance in the mirror and I'll be like, I'm like oh God, what am I doing? You know, and then I get self-conscious that other people have been like looking at me like, what is going on? Um, and I actually was scrolling through some of my videos from the past few years and it shocked me how many examples of it I found in past videos that I didn't even had, I really hadn't even noticed um, looking at the, my tongue before and the things, especially the Spartan races that I do. Um, it happens a lot when I do nunchucks and it was funny because I actually tried to film me doing nunchucks for this video but because I was like aware of it I could ne I never actually <laughs> did it because even though I was like focusing on the nunchucks I was also still like so aware of the tongue thing I, I never did it in like the five minutes I kept doing nunchucks but um, in past videos where yeah I'm concentrating on the nunchucks it happens quite a bit it's weird um, I've gotten used to it now that's one thing I can say I've definitely gotten used to it um, I'll be doing like some type of manual labor thing and suddenly realize it's happening and that freaks me out a little bit. Um, like I, I'll be, um, I work at a gym part time and I'll be like say mopping or cleaning something and like I'll suddenly realize like that my tongue is hanging out of my mouth weirdly and I kind of get freaked out. I hope no one saw that. <laughs> um, other than that though, it really doesn't bother me. Um, it's definitely gotten worse. I said over the past past year, like I said, uh, um, seeing it more and more popping up in my videos, like I said, I don't really notice when I'm doing it. I had no idea when I was bodyboarding that I was doing that. It was just really when I was going through the footage, and I'm like, crap, like, crap, Rachel. So, give me your thoughts. If you've experienced this, um, definitely put it down in the comments. Um, you know, if you don't feel comfortable with it, obviously, you know, but... What are your thoughts? If we have any like doctors, counselors, psychiatrists, whatever, um, watching this and have any thoughts on it, I would love for you to put it in the comments. The few times I've mentioned it to doctors, they don't seem to care. Like they're just like, okay. Um, one corrected me on how I said it, so I'm probably still saying it wrong. Get over it. I'm like, <laughs> I want to be like, ma'am, my tongue is going crazy, out of control, and you're trying to fix my pronunciation of the word. Okay, we're we're worried. We're 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 worried about two different things here. So, um, yeah, t tell me your thoughts. Like I said, doctors, the ones I've told it to don't really seem to care. It's just kind of like, oh, okay, just, you have that. And then I'm kind of in my mind thinking, it's a big deal. Um, you know, and I, I get it. I don't really think there's a cure for it. Um, and it's not like I'm hurting or anything, but it, it is a little unnerving when, when you realize suddenly your tongue's hanging out of your mouth and you didn't even realize it. And you're like, oh my God, how long have I been doing this? Uh, you know, what, what's happening there? So, yeah, tardive dyskinesia. Mental health videos and whatnot, please check out my mental health playlist, hitting on all types of different things, depression, thoughts of suicide, 
um, obviously hallucinations, things like that. And also, do check out my new book I have out. I have a book called Little Broken Star. It's specifically written towards children, but it's good for adults too. It's um, me talking to my younger self about what she's experiencing. So when I was growing up with hallucinations, um, depression, all those kind of things, and as a little kid, I didn't understand what was happening. Um, and it's kind of right away brought closure on me, so it's kind of cool. But it's it's me talking to my younger self, and it's kind of like a little workbook for I'm you know tell, also talking to the reader. What type of hallucination do you see? Um, so yeah, Little Broken Star out on Amazon um, and Kindle too. So definitely check that out down in the description or just Google on Amazon. Look up Little Broken Star or Rachel Star Withers. That's me. All right, thank you so much for watching. Um, have a great day.